All right, this game was incredibly difficult to actually find background information from. Um, I guess we can, can we make out the poster? I think the poster is too low, low res for us to even make out, but as far as I can tell, this is essentially a clone of um, Elimination, which we saw in 1973. So essentially it's, um, it's basically Pong, but you kind of have to protect your, your goals. And um, although Elimination was four player, it was basically four player, four player Pong, each player controlled one of four sides on the board. And if the ball went by your side, then you got eliminated. Well, you didn't get fully eliminated. I think you could allow five goals. And once you allowed the fifth goal, it would count down from five. Once you're at zero, you'd be eliminated. And, the, and you're like, let's say if you were playing on the left side, your whole area would seal up and then you'd be down to three players and then thus elimination. Um, this version, however, is actually, despite it coming after Elimination, which, by the way, to refresh our memories, Elimination was developed by Key Games, which, um, oh, you can't see that. Bring back the browser. Yeah, Elimination was from Key Games, which later kind of got absorbed by Atari, and Atari essentially came out with their own version called Quadrapong, but it was basically the same, same game. We'll play that. Uh, Wipeout from Ramtech is actually, instead of four players, it's two players, and each player controls two sides of the playfield. Um, I think left and right is one, is one player, and up and down is another player. Um, so it is not as advanced, uh, but I think it still has the same sort of counting down from five, but it's not as, it's kind of the cool thing I think from, uh, and you can actually see on the cabinet there, I guess you had you have different controls maybe for each of your two sides. Actually, if that's the case, couldn't it be four player? I don't know. That would seem to make sense. Maybe this was four player. The, the very little bit I read about it seems to suggest it's two player. In fact, when we actually play it, as you'll see in a moment, it seems to play out as two player. So, whatever. This is kind of a a poor man's version of elimination slash quadrupunk. Uh, there we also see a, a photo of the Ramtech office. Ramtech was a arcade uh, developer in the, uh, I guess, early to mid-70s. They kind of, I think they got died out, or... Can we find any, uh, in, let's see if we can find out any information on Ramtech. Kind of interesting, these early, early days of, uh, video game history. Uh... Oh, they... Don't they seem, seem to have any great information about it? Oh, well. Or, not from what I can see, at least. From a quick search. All right, I think the way this will work was that. Okay, let's see how this will work. There we go. Good enough. All right, so here you see our board. Let's uh, clear our timer. Um, again, this is gonna—you know—this is a two-player game. We're playing as one player, so it should be an easy victory for us. But I'll try to control both players. Let's see how this work works out. I think it's mouse and the WASD, I believe. All right, timer on, and let's begin. Hey, hang on, hang on. Let's actually stop. I, I think we need to turn down the volume. That's way too loud. Hey, stop that. In fact, we're gonna, yeah, put that way low. Way too loud. All right, let's try this again. <laughs> yeah, you're right, Penguin. You're right. All right, I put it. I put it pretty low, so hopefully this will be manageable. Hello. How do we start this? 
Oh, there we go. Okay, I can control the uh, upper paddle, but not. Okay, maybe it is four, four way. Yeah, you know what? It is four way. And I can't seem to figure out how to control the left and right players. So, all right, we'll just control these guys. But you can see it's counting down there. And they actually added this new thing of this sort of cross in the middle of the um, in the middle of the play field here. That's adding, I guess, an additional barriers. So the ones I'm controlling seem to be doing fairly well. All right, we almost got two of our guys eliminated here. There we go. He's gone. He now just becomes a solid wall for the guy that got eliminated. Wow, and the speed can pick up very quickly there. You get the right angle. Damn it. Ah. Okay, he's out. So now we're down to the two hippo controlled players. Interesting, they also give you like the very corners of the field are protected. All right, three lives left versus two lives left. Damn it. Well, I'm playing against myself. Why should I be upset? <laughs> All right, there it is. With three lives left, player one. Wins! Wipeout from Ramtech! The Quadruplon Elimination Clone. For fun for all four players! <laughs>